Hello, everybody. Meteorologist Hutch Johnson joining you as we head into the overnight hours. Strong and even severe storms are working their way in the region. Right now, we'll start with a look at the entire region. A very strong thunderstorm pushing in toward the Minot zone right now. Capable of nearly 80, 80 mile per hour winds measured just a few moments ago. And along the international border, we do have some strong cells working their way in on around that Cavalier to Walhalla area and even out towards Walla and Belcourt. Some hail along the international border from a few of these cells, but most of it should be nickel sized. Uh, we could see some gusts to around 40 miles per hour in these areas. These storms are moving northeast at 58 miles per hour heading into Kitson County. Uh, that easterly direction is more easterly than north, so keep that in mind, skirting along the border. Here's the big strong storm that has developed this one just with that wind report that was five miles southwest of partial 80 mile per hour, 78 mile per hour wind gust measured there. It's in New Newtown now. Here's the track of the storm as we go ahead and time it out for you, moving at that speed of about 45 miles per hour. Here's how long it'll take to get to Minot. Partial 1241, so very soon. Plaza about 1251. McCody, 1 o'clock, and Delax out there at 119. Douglas, same time. Burlington, 127. And if it continues at the same pace, it'll be in Minot by around 133. Prepare for very gusty wind and some core of hail, uh, hail core with that storm as well as it works its way off to the east. Again, from the weather service, one inch hail and up to 70 mile per hour gusts, but we just got a measurement of 78 mile per hour gusts. Dickinson, Hebron, and western parts of Morton County will be seeing showers as is much of southwestern North Dakota now. If storms form in your area, you know a few could be severe tonight. The main event heading towards Minot, that will move to the north and east as we go through what you see along the international border. I expect to work its way generally off into northwest Minnesota and skirt along the border as models have ad advertised over the last day and a half or so. I'm meteorologist Hutch Johnson thanking you for joining me. Uh, tonight, stay tuned and make sure if storms approach your area, you get the latest on Hutch'sWeather.com. Follow on Facebook, subscribe on YouTube, and until next time, stay safe. If you're in the Minot area, be prepared for a very windy and hail-producing storm in the next...